it's time for you to recognize the person that you are being is not the person that you have to be. It's time for you to be more motivated than you've ever been in your entire life, rather than settling for what you have. Chances are you didn't wake up one day and think, I just want to be a mediocre person. I want to be like everybody else. No, you had a burning desire to learn, to grow and evolve. The problem is that you settled into a world that said it's okay to be comfortable. It's okay to stay where you are. But the fact is, if you're staying where you are, you're going backwards. You see, to be motivated means to move through things. The word motivation comes from the Latin of motive. What is your motive for doing what you're doing? Let's be honest, you have goals. You have dreams, you have ambitions. We all do. We are what the Greeks called teleological. We are goal-centered creatures. We need targets, things to aim for. But most of us are just settling for things that don't give us the greatest joy. The fact is, we are all here to grow, to evolve and to contribute. Jim Rohn famously said that the difference between us and all of the other animals on the planet is that we have the dignity of choice. A tree doesn't think to itself, well, you know what, I've had enough of growing, I'm just going to stay here. No, it does what it is meant to do. Every living soul, every living cell lives for one reason. It lives to grow to express itself fully. Every day when we're not allowing ourselves to be who we are truly capable of being, there is a part of us that is dying. The question I want to ask you right now is, who do you want to become? What is it that you want to leave on this earth? In the book, The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People by Dr. Stephen Covey, he talks about the first two habits, to be proactive, to be active, to have the motivation to move through. But the biggest challenge that we all face in moving through life is the challenges that we have going on inside our own mind. A part of us that wants us to stay where we are, to stay with what is familiar, to stay with what is comfortable to us. There is a disease in the world right now and it's called being comfortable, settling for what you have. We are not settlers, we are hunters, we are gatherers. We are designed to move, to evolve, to move through, to move through the biggest battle we will ever face and it's the battle inside our mind right now or tomorrow when you wake up the battle begins